Hey guys, and welcome back to another video. Today we're going to be talking about how to edit like Matt Diavella. Now first off, it's important that you talk in a voice that you would use if you were maybe up past your bedtime and didn't want to wake your parents up, but something different than the typical YouTube voice, something that cuts straight to the heart of people's emotions, even though you're just making coffee. Another thing that you're going to want to do is make sure that everything is immaculately clean. You have to remember, you're a minimalist, and everything in the background of your video should look like Pinterest. You move over to put tap water in coffee, but then you remember, you're Matt Diavella, and you don't use tap water, you use filtered water. Do not use any moving shots, no 1080-120, because like I said, you're Matt Diavella, and you keep it simple. What you want to do is be making coffee in a contraption that most people have never seen. This will help convey that you're a connoisseur and knowledgeable about whatever it is that you're talking about. It's important to use a very shallow depth of field, and of course, film the entire sequence in 4K. Because like I said, you're Matt Diavella, and you would never shoot anything that isn't of the highest quality. As you continue making your coffee while talking about some important subject like personal finance or how to live a simple life, you're careful to show your apartment in certain angles that showcase the fact that dirt has never touched it. In fact, you don't even know what dirt is. This is a filmmaking sanctuary and you've been featured on Netflix. And soon you'll be able to say that you've had the rock on your podcast. As you begin the blooming process on the grounds, you're sure to leave a little bit of the grounds untouched just to irritate your viewers. You're measuring and timing your coffee in a simplistic way, yet somehow so complex that no one even knows what is going on. You center frame a lot of your shots and make sure that everything is clean and simple with only one thing for your eye to focus on. Remember, you're a minimalist. As soon as the coffee is done brewing, you begin this process of swishing the coffee. This is to make everyone jealous and realize the beautiful color of your beverage. And yes, you say beverage because you're Matt Diavella. As you finish pouring your coffee, you begin to walk back to your living room. It's important that you sit in the center of your couch, because that's what you do, and begin work on your thin laptop. This is how you film like Matt Diavella.